Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel, Kotsen. And I'm Dennis and today what I'm going to do is show you how to access your Cyber Panel portal or your dashboard in Cyber Panel when you're using Cloudflare. Everyone knows that Cloudflare does not support our uh, port number 8090. So when we're trying to access Cyber Panel dashboard or the login page, and we type in our domain name, colon 8090, in my case, kotzen.com, colon 8090. All I get is that little spinning wheel. Never go into it, never could do anything, and then you go into the internet or something, and it'll tell you all kind of stuff to do and whatever. Well, I'm going to show you a better and easier way to do it. And not only will it take care of your problem, it will allow you to use your domain name with a port, go into uh, Cloudflare, but it will also be proxied through Cloudflare and be secure. As you can tell right now, the only way we can pretty much access it is through our IP address, colon 8090, and it's never secure. So we're going to get that taken care of today. All right, the first thing we need to do is go down to where it says server status. If you already logged in, if you haven't, do that. Go ahead and log in, and then when you get logged in, go down to server status, click it, and you will see port or change ports. Now, this is what we're going to do. We're going to change this port to a port that is recognized and supported by Cloudflare, and this is the best way I could tell to see to get things completed. When we go into change port, it'll bring you into this page right here. It says cyber panel port. And is, of course, you can see our default port is 8090, which is still unsupported by Cloudflare. What we're going to do is change this port to a recognizable port by Cloudflare. And I'm going to show you how to do that. First thing I need you to do is I'm going to show you the supported ports for Cyber Panel and, of course, uh, Cloudflare. And, of course, this is our HTTP port. Oh, excuse me. Y'all got that. This is our HTT port. As you can tell, it's in red, I put it. All the ports, that's, uh, they're not secure ports, but they're ports supported by Cyber or Cloudflare. And here's our HTTPS ports. And any one of these ports would be good, but I got a liking for port 8443. That's a port I use sometimes in Plask, and that's a, their default port, and that's the one I'm going to use in Cyber Panel. So what we need to do now is go back into where it says change port and put one of these supported port numbers in there. Well, we're back into where we're changing port again. Of course, this is the number we're going to change is right here. And you can put any number into it you want. I'm going to put number 8443, and I'm going to click the Change button. So go ahead and do that right now. But before we do that, I'm going to open a new tab, and I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. If I put in my domain name, kotzen.com, colon, 8090, and click Enter, as you could tell, all it's going to do all day long is sit there and spin. It, I could leave it here two or three hours. It's just going to do just that because the port 8090 is not supported or recognized by Cloudflare. So when we change this support or Cloudflare, uh, I get a different port that supports it, uh, of course, it's going to change everything. It go in, it's going to be uh, using your domain, and it's going to be secured and proxied through Cloudflare. So that is what we got. So let's just go ahead and get everything changed over. Okay, everyone, let's go back and try it now since we got everything entered. And I'm going to type in my domain name and you type in yours. And of course, mine is kotzen.com colon. I'm putting the new port number 8443 in and I'm click enter. And as you can tell, it'll bring us right into the cyber panel. Uh, I guess the login page, unless it brings you all the way in there in case you haven't logged out or something. So it works. Now we're going to log in and we're going to see if it's secured and proxy through Cloudflare. Of course, I'm just logged in. Now, as you could tell, just like it is, and guess what? I'm using the port 8443 under my domain name and it is secure. 
Okay, y'all, well, the last thing I'm going to show you is what I'm talking about when I say proxy through Cloudflare. I'm opening a new tab. I'm going to go into whatsmydns.net. Y'all can go into this, try this on your name. And let me tell you what I'm talking about. When you've seen some of these articles out there that tell you how to bypass the proxy of Cloudflare. Well, when you're doing that and you're exposing your IP address, you're basically eliminating some of the security that Cloudflare offers by exposing your IP address to everyone. Well, I'm going to go to www.cotson.com and I'm click search. And as you can tell, I'm still being proxied through Cloudflare because all the names or the IP address is coming back Cloudflare. If it wasn't proxied through Cloudflare, it would show my original IP address. So I, well, I could take off the www and we'll try it just regular Kotzen. The same thing. 